bumps the axe. Prove yourself! work but there's the searing chains and logic falling low on this pa can't you get back to her tower she's blocked there's just too many heroes here and a logic is going to go down for your first blood and now onto one of these heroes here then it's quite easy to see uh avila able to come forward with the purification it's a lot of damage is it enough i don't know meanwhile arjit in the middle lane okay start to the lane five and over versus six and one so that's all right a little bit behind but now has that wand. Oh, we actually have the kill down at bottom lane though, as Yol is actually able to find the kill on to the uh, flesh rack. No. Naville will continue just to farm up here. Meanwhile, PA in the top lane going down very low. The diamond under tower right click from Boombax will come through. Go off onto Skylark, however, as they're trying to turn it around, doing the damage to this DP. She has a Crypt Swarm available. Is it worth it to kill White Mon? Skylark thinks not. Trying to get to the tree line, but the dagger comes through from Illogic, and Boombax just trying to find White Mon here. White Mon trying to get fancy around the tree line. Creeps are here to help him out, but there's the ice shards, and Boombax will find three. You know, he dies quickly. And this lightning bolt, purification as well, really scary for them to play against. Throws down another soul catcher, but they'll be able to find the stun onto Yol. Nice split earth through the tree lines from Teku. And uh, that's going to secure them a kill. More iconic duo. You know, let's up. Boom backs. Uh oh, he could be in trouble. He does have that snowball. And actually manages to get to range three. Just about dodging the orb. But another day, another coil. And Boom backs gets taken out. And Skylark, he's got nowhere to go. Clutch game is finally up. Though the... No, no, it's not enough. Surely, yeah, they finish him off with the orb. But Earth does miss onto Gabby here, and there's two heroes coming around the back. Arjit is here. Avir, well, he's got that repel available. Can they chase him down into the tree line? They really want to dive for this one as a repel runs out, and they find the kill. Boombag's actually getting that one. Twice got two kills in total. Arjit rotated once and, and got one kill in total, so, you know. Uh oh. Th those are crits then. Okay. Pick another hero, and you can make some space, you know? Pick, pick the Pangolier, or pick something like a. Oh, yeah. uh, heroes rotating in on him. Then you find yourself in a really nice position where you're forcing space, and Boomback's getting picked off, and Logic gets another. Trying to make Vlad's a thing, it's never going to be a thing. Ancient Apparition, though, well, he might not be a thing in a minute, as Gabby's just going to run off his cold feet and run straight back into Whiteman here. Stun available. Doesn't even want to use it, we'll use it in the end. Uh, trying to save mana, I guess. Meanwhile, face hugger. Coming forwards, y'all in a weird position right now. Can he get out of this one? But no, the crit comes through with the silence as well. I have to find his power shreds and the uh, kill. It's a, not horrible, but this could be a kill here. It's a got this soul catcher as well. Snowball coming through, and it's really hard to see how Puck gets out of this one. In fact, he doesn't expect. But Clutch still have this kind of cheesy strat with the uh, the shard demon. Uh oh, Gabby, Gabby, this is not the place for you. <laughs> the logic finds yet an Ember Spirit with the treads, Phantom Assassin with the Vlads. What? Well, this is a this is a new reign of Dota with Logic jumping in straight onto Boombacks here. Can they take down Facehugger? He's getting low, but looks like he's able to get out of this one despite the ghost chasing beautiful stun onto three. And now they'll find the kill onto Boombacks. And Logic he really wants to give chase here, jumping forwards onto Skylark, but the ghosts, there's too many ghosts, and they will bring her down, and now the disruption out gonna save him, but Teku is there with the stun, taking down Skylark, actually coming forwards, gotta be careful, this is a level 8 flesh rack, nothing to be messed with, but talking nothing to be messed with, Gabi runs in with the Eclipse, able to find flesh rack. Grant's life steal, 15% from here is 10% range, and jumping straight forwards onto Yol here, Yol this is a bad place for you to be, already used that disruption and does get blown up, did use it to help Gabi farm, meanwhile up it, jumping in though on beautiful shards, now catching two off, as Omni Knight four stars himself past it, and they will kill the... Leshrak. Looks like they want to disengage though. Uh oh. Ajit might not find a way out of this one as they are all jumping in, but the rest of Clutch Game is still sticking around for this one. I'm not too sure why. Surely they can't do this. They will find a feel, and Gabby comes back in. Ajit actually buybacks straight into this game. Can he kill Facehugger? They certainly can. I think that is from Bills. So Power Treads, Maelstrom. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, middle lane, Boombax gets taken out as the PA finds another one. Gotta be said, she's getting a lot of kills for this, going for the, uh, the Desolator next. Meanwhile, top, they're trying to put pressure on, but the puck comes straight in, and Facehugger doing what Facehugger does best. Meanwhile, oh, Gabby actually able to find Ember Spirit going straight for the Maelstrom, just playing like a traditional carry, not really going to be utilizing the Fire Remnants that much. 
Meanwhile, on the top, hanging around, jumping down the tree line, once again going to the orb, and it doesn't look like they're gonna find him. Another remnant is still available. Meanwhile, though, this is a big. The first tower. Oh, jumping forwards here, and poor old Yol just gets to go medieval. Uh, boom backs. Not where you want to be. Not where you want to be at all. The Maelstrom, right? That's just not really that scary at this stage in the game, especially with the slow start he's had. Jumping onto the puck hit. Never mind. So, Ember Spirit deeply apologize. I didn't know what I was doing. Gabby could be in trouble. Has got the BKB though. Disruption straight out from Yol. Nice reactions there. Now throwing the push down onto a Logic. BKB pop from Yabby. Just wants to get away from this one, but Logic is giving chase. Tempting to use this Eclipse right now. Is Gabby gonna do it? Meanwhile, thrown up into the air. No repel is available, but Gabby actually gets out of this one. I was thinking maybe for the turnaround, but y'all will get picked off. No escape from that TP. They're not scared. They've got this Aegis on the PA, so really, they're not bothered and they're going to have to throw up the Death Prophet. She has got these ghosts available, which jumps down so quickly. Buyback is available. This has been like deja vu of last game, but for the other team, as Evo's just sitting on the high ground, but, well... Emma just jumps in and is able to do quite a lot of damage. White Mon does go down, but Yola Boobacks drop. Now comes the Eclipse coming forward, so Avila able to get off that GA. Who can they find it? Only protects you from the physical damage, remember? And Logic just going straight back in now. Kaya Skylark with the ghost running around. Avila getting low. Purify up, trying to get away from this one, but dropping really low. But it's going to fall Mon now into the middle of it all. In comes a Puck, just trying to slow him down and turns it around. Will kill Skylark. Illogic in the middle of it all, but he's got that Aegis available, so going to come straight back to life. Ajit and Gabi going to fight him around, trying to get him. What's he going to do? It's going to go aggressive. He's going to go defensive. Get stunned up actually in the middle of it all. Searing chains as well. Trying to get some damage off. Jumping back. Well, just about to survive. And now the turnaround coming. They actually managed to find the kill onto the Lesh Rack. But Ajit's the one to fall. The crit comes through from a logic. But back we go with Ajit. Just trying to make something of this fight. They need to get something. It's going to find one. And looks like Phantom Assassin going to go down as well. And able to find the crit. Oh, excuse me. Pulling my microphone out. Good job, and Miltow will be going down. Meanwhile, Skylight gets picked off, and this is going down in the top lane. Hit. Ajit is going to stick his head in. Could actually be in trouble here. There's a lot of heroes rounding around, but his other team coming up behind him as well. Engine Apparition kind of falling a bit low here, as uh, Ember Spirit just remnants himself out of this one. Coil will be used. Now Roshan gets spotted out. Whoop. Gabby, able to find the kill onto Whiteman. You know, what, what's he going to use anyway? Shiva's guard, not a big deal. Well, does find the kill it's available. Aeon will be popped. Now goes the Yoza Logic jumping in with the nullifier and does kill Skylux. There's a nullifier usage we find going on to Tusk as well. Meanwhile, in the back of the fight, Leshrac goes down, but there's the ultimate. The GA is not enough to save a Logic from all of this damage, but he does have the Aegis. Remember, BKB up from Luna, fighting up versus Logic. Doesn't want to man fight this PA. Needs to keep his distance. Meanwhile, Ajit in the middle, popping that BKB, and the PA is going to go down once. This is a good fight from Clutch so far, despite losing two heroes, although Yol getting caught out on the back lines, they kind of needed that guy, and he's going to buy back immediately, getting back into this fight. Ajit, going to jump forwards with all of the remnants, and immediately get back out again, trying to kind of duke it out a little bit, though, throwing two, making it look like three, oh, what is... Oh, no, I think this could be it, actually, as the Luna gets taken outside the base, does have the buyback available, though. And if they can kill this guy, it'll be huge, but he actually manages to get back into base. Now turning around to Boombacks, however, the Tusk, well, he's not going to be the survivor of this one. Meanwhile, Logic just running through. They want to end this game, and there's a crit onto Skylark. No chance for survival. Now Garby trying to get back to base, but the Nullifier is out. No, you, you can't use a BKB. Logic just fighting him on the base of his throne. One more hit, and ends it with a crit. A grand finale, indeed for Illogic as he jumps onto the Ember Spirit and there is that Hex out, everybody's dead, Evos. Hex from Puck though, like two huge Hexes in that fight, absolutely proving the worth of that item infinitely. They're even going to jump into base to kill that uh, 